Yo, you probably don't hear this a lot, but this herb here has sentimental value to me. It has sentimental value. Why? When I was in the grips of an opiate addiction, this herb brought back the clarity of my mind. It was in the deep fog. I was addicted to opiates for five years. I've been clean seven. And when you were taking opiates, see, I was addicted to morphine and Percocet. I was prescribed that. I was prescribed that from my primary care physician. I got that prescription when I was 18 or 19 years old. And initially, I sold the stuff. But we all know how that goes. You end up getting high on your own supply. So with chronic use, it kill it zaps your testosterone. It zap you it it kills it. And along with that you lose muscle mass and bone density. You start becoming more feminine physically and in your nature. So, I said, yeah, forget this. I'm going to get off this shit and detoxify my body. So, I went about it. And with, um, in a naturopathic way, with herbs. I didn't go to a program or a clinic. I did it at home with the assistance of herbs. And this one... I chose initially because my dick stopped working. My dick stopped working. Basically. So I found Murapuama from the Rio Negro portion of the Amazon. What this herb does not do is raise your blood pressure to force blood into the penis like most sexual performance enhancing substances. What this does is relaxes an area of the penis called the corpus cavernosa to allow for more blood flow into the penis. In addition, to providing the cofactors to increase your testosterone. That's why I picked this plant initially. But what I found first through experience is that this plant is a nootropic. What's a nootropic? A nootropic is a mental performance enhancing substance in a nutshell. <clears throat> My focus memory, overall cog mental cognition, it was coming back and I felt it, even, even as I was going through withdrawal, see, I found out that this herb, Murapuama, inhibits an enzyme called acetylcholinerase, choline trace. Why is this important? Stops the breakdown of acetylcholine, which is a necessary function, the breaking down of acetylcholine, but allowing for higher concentrations in the brain increases your memory concentration and cognition. They're studying this plant now for those who suffer from dementia, dementia and Alzheimer's. So I felt the, I felt the herb bringing me up out of this shit. And 
with that, I started feeling like my old self. And I started remembering who I was before the opiates, and that was really emotional in a good way. It was really emotional. And I felt strong, not just physically, but I started feeling strong in my mind. This plant's a central nervous system stimulant. It's anxiogenic. The natives of Brazil and this area of Brazil where this plant comes from, they use this plant in turbulent times. They use it during tr turbulent times. Uh, specifically, they also use it for um, uh, for sexual function for men and women. But they also use it during turbulent times to stay mentally sharp and ready. To be um, not necessarily in control of their flight or fight, but to respond to it better. Because it can mean life or death. That's Murapuama, this shit. An herb. And like I said, man, I, I, it has sentimental value to me because of what it, it did for me. And I know it can, I know a lot of you all, maybe it, the uh, benefit won't be as profound for you, but you know, trust me, this shit works. This shit works. All right, I'm not gonna hold y'all too long. Take care. See y'all next time. Peace.